we need to go someplace warm. What's up everybody? It's Jack from Atlantis Water Gardens. No, I'm not someplace warmer yet. I am with Alan Decker though. You've seen this guy before. We're up at his place in Pattersonville, New York. If you haven't seen this before, check out this episode right here. Alan and Jody have an amazing spot up here. All kinds of water features, beautiful stores. Make sure you check that out. But the reason I'm here today is because this and this are going to Arizona. Right, Alan? Yes, can't wait. Sunny state. It's funny you say you can't wait. We really shouldn't have to wait. Should we just go now? We could. I mean, the weather's bad. Have you ever done time travel before? Let's try it. We need to find a door. Right through there is Arizona. You ready? Yeah, I'm ready, but it <laughs> looks pretty crappy outside. <laughs> oh my God. You don't know how much I've missed you. Oh, bud. <laughs> oh. If you're done loving on your bike, we got somewhere to be. We got an adventure to get on. Welcome to warm, sunny Arizona. Ralph, what the <laughs> <laughs> We are in Williams, Arizona, right? Yeah. We are gonna take a train ride to the Grand Canyon. You're gonna see that here shortly. I'm gonna do a bit of a 2018 review where we've been this year, this exciting trip we've been on with this vlog camera in my hand. I'm gonna tell you our plans for 2019, so let's take this group of misfits and get going. It has taken my wife, Joanne and I, over 40 years to finally get here. And we are at the Grand Canyon. I'm so happy we could share this with our sons at a much earlier age because we've been dreaming about coming here for quite a long time. This is the perfect place for us to start our look back in 2018 and all the exciting adventures we've had on this channel and all the cool things that we've done for people. So let's get that started right now. 2018 has been a completely wild ride for us as a family because I've dedicated a lot of time to this. It's taken a third partner in our marriage and in our family life. So we have to share him with that as well as, you know, everything else he does. Yeah, so it has been a huge sacrifice for Joanne and my boys, but this all started last January in Colombia, South America. Here's the backstory. I worked in Colombia for about two months in 2016, working on a once in a lifetime project, which was all the water features we did at Primavera Urbana with Aquascape. Ed Ballou, Brian Helfrich, and there was a whole cast of Aquascape water feature artists that put this entire project together. Last year, I got a chance to go back there and visit it, and that's what started this whole vlogging adventure because I wanted to capture that whole experience because we're doing a motorcycle ride through the, the country of Colombia, which it's something I never thought I'd get the experience to do. The fact that I build water features has brought me to places 
like this, like Columbia, like Florida, like Arizona, all these places I've been just in the last year, and I'm so thankful for that. After returning home from this epic life experience, I talked to my good friend Greg Woodstock, the pond guy, and he encouraged me to continue doing what I was doing with the Columbia vlog, and that's how this all kind of evolved. So now, let's recount how we got started turning this into a water feature vlog and all the cool things that have been created and experienced along the way. I'm freaking terrified. <laughs> it's not funny. I'm pretty sure I could send my drone up right here. Yeah. Without getting caught, but no. she won't let me. No, because I don't want to get kicked out and arrested. It might be worth it. No. Let's go somewhere warmer. <laughs> this because you guys have really bad lighting. We're in Arizona, which was supposed to be warm when we came here. You're welcome. This is Ralph and Allison b -Sad. You've seen Ralph tons of times in this vlog. One of my very good friends who I try to go on many adventures with, this being one of them. And I'm fortunate enough to bring my wife and my, my two kids out here to enjoy Arizona a little bit colder than we expected. So after Columbia, I come home, I talk to Greg, and uh, Ralph had a job going on with Weedem and Reap. At the time, I think they had like 100,000 subs. Right. So I really wanted to come out and work on the job and see how this whole vlog thing worked. It was interesting because I'm watching Danelle and Kevin do their filming and how they narrate things and how they tell a story with the camera along with us getting the project done. And the way that turned out was, of course, it was fantastic. We built a 35 foot by 25 foot recreational pond, five feet deep, something that they could use not only just to enjoy looking at it, but they wanted to swim in it, grow tilapia fish, and integrate it into their filming of their life on their farm in Gilbert. This was my first experience as a vlog wife when he went away and filmed <laughs> Do over. I wasn't prepared for all the hours he would spend editing and all the equipment and taking over my kitchen. So I was a little upset. It takes a lot of getting used to. So we get finished with the Weedman Reed build with Ralph and Allison. And I get home and like Joanne just said, I spent all this time editing and stuff. And I'm really trying to analyze if this is something that's going to be for us as a family and we decide, okay, let's give this a year, right? Is that what we said? Right. We'll give it a year and we'll see how it goes. Well, I really am enjoying it. I think it's getting better, right? Yeah, we'll go with that. <laughs> it's getting better, I think. And when I say that, it means getting better with us and, and time management. We're working our way through it. My next exposure to the vlogging life 
was with Greg Whitstock, we went to build a pond for Paul Cafaro. That's really what sent this channel going in the upward direction because coming home from that build, after we spent a day with Paul building this, uh, his backyard pond, I come home and we're over a thousand subscribers in like a day. I was like, holy cow, this is, this is really happening. Then we're rolling. We're just, we're doing vlogs every week about all these projects that we build at home. Again, we're back down in Florida with Ralph and April building for Paul again, and that's just helping the channel grow and grow and grow. We get exposed to Rob Barrington from Deer Meat for Dinner, another huge influencer for us. And we're just getting more and more of these relationships going where now the channel's starting to kind of skyrocket more than I ever thought it would. 2018 has been a crazy adventure. You guys have gotten to see a lot of kind of the behind the scenes stuff with how we run things back in New Jersey and all the water features that we built. So summertime hits, we're visiting Alan Decker, we're visiting Tom Smith, both friends of mine, and they have great water feature businesses. So for me to expose you guys to what all my friends are doing, I think that's part of what we're trying to accomplish here. Just get more people engaged and interested in the water garden lifestyle that we all live and that we all work in. Okay, now we're rolling through Pondemonium. We're doing our big motorcycle trip and you guys get to see how much our pond family means to us because most of the friends that I have, my really good friends, build water features for a living. And it's funny the, the synergy or the symmetry that we all have. It's a connection that we just can't explain. For us to bring our families together because of what we do for a living, it's really special. And it's, it's something that we're all very thankful for. I can't run you through every single job we did this year, but if you want to check it out and if you think that we might provide some sort of value on this channel, Go back, take a look at some of the other episodes that we've done with all my friends. You'll get a feel for what we're all about here. 2018, in the books. Hope you guys have enjoyed what we've done up to this point. We've got a lot of big plans for 2019. And of course, it's more water feature builds, more over the top stuff, more adventures with my friends on this channel. Want to share that stuff with you. Hope you guys had a great 2018. Here's to a fantastic 2019. If you guys like what we're doing over here, please hit that subscribe button. Drop me a comment. I do read them and leave me a like if that's what you want to do. And stay tuned because we are about to start an adventure with this guy, Alan Decker and April Frost. We are getting on motorcycles and we're going to tour Arizona, hopefully like the warmer part of Arizona. And we're going to show you some of Ralph and Allison's beautiful work down here. How ponds work in Arizona is a little bit different than how they work in New Jersey. So that's going to be interesting. You guys check it out. We'll see you on the next one. Ready for the booze?